when I was in high school, some people I went to school with owned harness horses. They took me out to Sportsman's Park. I liked the atmosphere. I liked the fun of the racetrack. I got involved in the gambling aspect. I always thought I would be some type of sports broadcaster. I thought I'd be a play-by-play announcer for baseball. Well, I decided, well, the racetrack was a lot of fun. I think I'm going to try that. Phil George F. helped me out a lot. 1982, I started at Bell, or 1979, I started at Quad City Downs, replaced the great Tom Dirk in there. 1982, when Tom Durkin went out to the Meadowlands, I replaced him at Balmoral, became the full-time announcer there. I was there for 20 years. Uh, left there to come to Hawthorne full-time. I've worked for the Carey family since 1990 in some capacity or another, whether it be the racing office, press box, or whatever. And now I'm full-time here, and this is the only track I work at at Illinois. We have a spring meet and a fall meet. Summer, I go up to uh, Minnesota, work at a harness track called Running Aces Harness Park. Actually, I have not had any in the past few years. The last one I had is the gentleman that's at uh, Harris Chester, James Weatherite. He's the last one that's really come up to me and asked me for some advice and things like that. Scott Ehrlich, years ago, I helped him along in his career. But no, not, not recently. And what I tell them is basically what every announcer tells every other announcer, you need the experience. Try and get some experience. When I first started out back in the 70s, I worked various county fairs throughout Illinois. They all have harness racing. I slept in my car many a time just to work the county fair. I've left other jobs to work the county fairs. So you just try and get as much experience as you can.